Hey, what is up everyone? Just going to do a very quick video today on some solutions and fixes for the sound and speaker problem on the Samsung Galaxies and the Notes. So as you can see here, this phone is very small. It's actually a Samsung Galaxy Young, I'm pretty sure. Um, but anyway, I'm just going to use this as a demo just to show you guys the methods that have been successful for other people as well. Um, so first off, I'll show you a solution, very simple, very obvious. I've been guilty of it a few times, and that is to go into settings, and then go down to sound, and then go into volume. So this allows you to adjust uh, kind of the volume levels on different categories of your phone. So you want to bring those back up if they are down low. And another solution, and this one is quite successful, um, if there's a glitch on your phone, if there's any kind of bad apps running in the background that might be causing the problem, this might eliminate that glitch. Uh, so what you want to do is you want to hold on to the power button for at least a few seconds, which will give you a prompt menu, and you will be able to restart the phone. So I'm not going to do that during this video. I'll go on to the next solution. So this solution is quite odd, I guess you can call it. Um, I've done a similar tutorial on the iPhones on how to fix the sound problem and this one has been one of the most successful um, kind of fixes for iPhone users and it also is quite successful for the Samsung users as well. And that is by cleaning the headphone jack and the charging micro SD port down the bottom. So we clean these kind of areas because if there is any dirt or grime in those areas it can actually trick the phone into thinking that headphones might be plugged in or it is on a music dock so it won't play any sound or any music through the speakers but it will allow the phone to ring so if you have those symptoms maybe give this one a try um, it is very successful so a good way to do this is by getting an old toothbrush make sure it's clean and just kind of force it in there I guess <laughs> And, um, you know, just clean these areas. And you'd actually be surprised how much dirt and dust you remove from there as well. So after you've done that solution, another good one to try is by going into settings, going down to about device, and checking for any software updates. So maybe if the previous update, there might have been a bug or a glitch for the sound so it's always good to just check for updates as well and another successful solution solution that I recommend is by squeezing the speaker on the phone so it actually might be a hardware issue so I always take the back off the phone um, if you have a new Samsung Galaxy S6 you can still try this method but you will just have to squeeze on the phone case itself so for this phone I'm going to squeeze around the speaker area. So if, in case the kind of speaker connectors um, have come loose or if they're a bit kind of rugged, then you can just kind of squeeze around here. I mean, it's a bit of a long shot, but it actually can kind of put those connectors back into place. And um, yeah, so give that one a shot. You don't want to put too much force into it, but you want to put enough strength into it that it might move something. So, um... Those are the solutions um, that have been successful for other people. Um, I've actually got an article an article about this on my website. I'll put a link down below. Um, so please like or dislike, guys, and please subscribe as well. Hope you enjoyed this video, and all the best. Thank you.